why you need to do back to sender for three days in this month of September. I'm going to be showing you a lot of things you're going to be doing this month of September in order to stop them before they stop you. All right. And in doing this thing, so, so simple, very, very effective. You'll be needing white candle. Hi, amazing people. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to this place. The Lord said I should come and share this recipe with you. Yes, our Lord Jesus. He said I should share this recipe with you. He said you should call him with this method. Call him in prayer. Call him in fasting. He's going to answer you in a massive way. Yes, guys, this prayer is one prayer to kill your enemy. Kill their plans before they kill you. Kill their plans before you they kill you. That is just it. Kill the plans of the enemy. All their plans to monitor you, to cause your affliction, to block your way. Kill their plans before they kill you. And guess what? You'll be killing them with fire. You'll be killing them with fire. We have earth. We have air. We have fire. We have land. We have water. So we are, be, we are going to kill their plans with fire. So please, this September, white candle. And when are you going to do this prayer? Three days. Must it be at night? No. It's not a composure at night. It can be in the morning. It can be in the afternoon. All right? When you get your paper, like you write your name, your family name, your business name, any contract you have been lobbying in, you'll be wanted to get that contract. It's not working. Marriage. My marriage. My husband to be his business, whether you are engaged or not, whether you are in a relationship or not. Do you understand? My health, my expectation. Do you understand? Write it in a piece of paper as big as whatever it is. Get this candle, evil plots from a man, from a woman, from a spirit, or any being return to sender. All right. This part of this can to get your razor, cut it off. Okay, cut it off because somebody that I gave, I was telling about this prayer, was asking me, How am I going to do the question? Was too much, and I decided to make this video so that I will save myself so that I don't go die. Where the answer question, yeah, the question was too much, so I decided to make this video to showcase it. You are working in the place of work. Do it. Some people say, what of if I don't have money to buy candle? Uncle? If you don't have money to buy three sticks of white candle, please, when you get one, cut it half. If you know you cannot pray for so long, cut it half so that it will burn fast. But the rule is that you have to turn the plans of the enemy upside down to gain your freedom, to kill their plans. Before they kill you, turn the candle upside down. So this time, you're going to use razor to scrape it. Scrape it until you get this rope. You get this rope because that's what you're going to light. So once you have done writing, you're going to go on your knees. You're reading Psalm 9 and start praying. After you read Psalm 9, you read Psalm 1. The Bible says, whatever I lay my hand will prosper. Anyone that wants to fight me, my prosperity, God, I am asking for your intervention. Am I asking you to contend with them that want to contend with my shining, my progress, my blessing, my joy, my testimony, my, my celebration, my healing. Maybe you have an injury or you are sick. You are trying everything. It's not working. I discovered with somebody. And she was telling me she was heavy, this and this, that and that. You know, anyone contending, say, the more I look for solution, the more things become tougher. You are not my creator. I didn't come this life with you. You didn't bring me this life. And I have the power. Luke 10, 19, he has given me the power to triple up your scorpions and pythons. And if I drink any deadly poison, it will not harm me. So if God gave you assurance that even if you drink a poison, it will not harm you. My dear, you are a maid of honor. You are a maid of honor. 
God has put high value in you. Don't let any trash to talk you down or to make you feel you are nothing, you are worthless. You can't rise, you can't shine. In your family, who is doing that? They marry you, say they marry you without your consent. You are turning the marriage down by turning this candle down. Power fighting me from my father, from my mother, paternal side. As I'm turning, I turn your activities over my life, my family. I turn you down and I burn you to ashes using this candle. Now, a candle in the book of Revelation represents the lifespan of a man. The Bible says there are seven churches and seven candles that represent the seven churches. Yes. Light represents the life you are living. When the light is off, you are dead. Darkness take over. Light shining in darkness. Darkness cannot comprehend it. All right. So once you have done praying, all those pray, writing on this candle, okay, then what are you going to do? If you have alligator pepper, choose some. Spit it on your hand, pa, 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 and rub it on the candle. If you don't have alligator pepper, just do like this. Generate your own energy heat and rub it on the candle. Rub it. I bring you that. Bring them that. Okay. Even if it's your mother and your mother, father, you don't know, then make a hole with the candle at the center. See, I make this one so that it will be easy for me. The video will not be done. No? So you just make a hole. As I turn this candle outside down, Every plot over you. In the name of Jesus, I turn it upside down. See? You see what I'm showing you? I turn the candle upside down. Okay? Yes. So once you turn it upside down, you now begin to pray. I call God the Father, God the Son, and the Holy Spirit to show me mercy. I call my guardian angels, angel. Or Psalm 35, Angel of Psalm 91, Dine Chebim, Dine Jeremosi, those that are working for me and those that I'm working for. I call you to bear witness. I call the whole universe to bear witness. That today, I am turning all the plans of the enemy upside down and I'm destroying them with this power of this light in Jesus' name. Go ahead and own your candle. Own it like this. Remember, I told you, cut off this place with your razor. So that it can be able to sit on your candle. Because by this, it will not balance. But once you remove this place, you place it like this, it will balance. All right? Then you stand it and you start praying. You start praying. Somebody will say, Bible verse. Use all the Bible verse you know. Number one, Numbers 14, 14. Exodus 14, 14 to 15. Psalm 35. All right. Yes. And Isaiah 49, verse 25 to 26. Okay. Then you pray. And when you are praying, 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 you are done praying, you appreciate God. Maybe you can do other things. When you come back and see the candle has burned up to this place. Up to this place, eh? Lift up the candle and remove the paper and place the candle to burn down. Okay. Now you are sleeping, you are carried away before you come. The paper, the candle has finished burning and the paper got burnt. It simply means that whatever they have done over your life. Has been destroyed totally. Okay. Has been destroyed. Whatever they have done over your name, anything they have done against you has been born to ashes. But be at a lot. When it's burning down, burning down, you can remove the paper. Let the candle burn down totally. The prayer has answered. The prayer has been answered. Then this one. What do you do? You tear it to pieces. But if you are carried away, you slept or something happened, the paper got burnt. There is no cause for alarm. 
so that you will not start panicking me. I'm sure I'm so. Hey, le, 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 oh. Hey, le, 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 oh. What can I do? Does it mean? Mm -mm. The last back to send I did. Before I say Jack, both the candle, both all the papers, all the names, me include money, everything was burned down. It shows that there are heavy attack, heavy monitoring spirits upon you. Because the candle will burn fast. Fia, 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 fia. So that is it. And we are going to be doing this back to sender for three days. For three days. Somebody will say, must it be three days? Today, tomorrow, I said three times. Three times in a week. If you are doing it this week, let it be this week. Three times. Day one, it can be in the morning. Day two, it can be in the afternoon. Day three, it can be at night. Don't do it at one particular time. Day one, it can be in the afternoon. Day two, it can be in the evening. In the night, in the night. Day three can be in the midnight hour of 2, 3 a.m. Yes, that is how we are going to do this powerful back to send. And I bet you will enjoy it. Your life will be free and the cleansing. God bless you, like you, share, subscribe. To order for any spiritual item, that is my WhatsApp number.